So, how long have I been dead? A little over seven years. Jesus. It's probably overwhelming, isn't it? I mean, yeah. One second, I'm there. I'm lying on the floor, bleeding with a bullet in my chest. And then I blink, and I'm falling out of that tank. I'm sorry I couldn't save you. So, Phantom Code here really dead. Yeah, that's a. That's a couple years after you sacrificed himself so the rest of us could live. <sighs> Damn it. Don't worry though. The guy that did it's dead. I killed him myself. And the kid? I wasn't there. The guy that brought you back killed him. Went there after me, this guy Jimmy, and uh, Luke. Went to hunt him down. He destroyed the town. Killed everyone in it. How do you know Cody's dead? Travis showed me pictures of the town in flames. And he had Cody's gun. There's no way he would have been able to get that without killing him. I'm sorry, Ace. Yeah. He was a good kid. Put your hands where I can see them. Come on! Just put your damn hands up! So, I'm gonna ask you a couple questions. Adam, just do as he says. Good. You're gonna cooperate. Now, either of you got a name? I'm Reese, and that's Adam. Get on with already. I suggest you start being a little less rude, or I'll kill you. You have me surrounded with four other guys. If you were gonna kill me, you would've already done it. So, get on with questions. Fine. How many of the dead have you killed? Me? Too many to count. I'm not sure. Have you ever turned someone into a walker or let them turn? Yeah. 
couple of times I kill a couple of guys. Let them turn. What's it to you? I'm asking the questions. Follow up. How many people have you killed? Again. Too many to count. What? And you? Oh. Uh. Again, I don't know. <laughs> Sorry about that. The name's Gordon. That Steve right there, our brute? Over there in the camo is, uh, Vinny. Next to him is the life of the party. Monty, or, uh, Montgomery. Right over there, in the vest, is, uh, Jeremiah. Well, it's, uh, nice to meet you all, I guess. Beats being gunned down by you. Don't worry, you're right. If we were gonna kill you, we would have already done it. We feel the same about you. So, you got any questions to ask us? Yeah, I've got a few. You guys search this place. I'm gonna sweep his hard drive. Grant, over here they have medical supplies, food, ammunition. It's enough that we're gonna have to take multiple trips to get it back. Good, good. Liam, what did you find? There are human remains inside of these safes. What? Seriously? Jesus Christ. Grant, what do you want us to do with those? Burn up. <laughs> what? I said. Cannot afford for Travis to bring back another psychopath. You know what? Burn the building. We need the gasoline for a car. The car won't matter if we're getting hunted by four psychopaths instead of three. So, burn it. And what are you gonna do while we do that? I'm downloading his hard drive. Secret to getting a cure might be hidden somewhere on it. But in the meantime, start burning this bitch to the ground. Jesus Christ. So, you're saying there's a crazed maniac out here in the city? And he's trying to kill your group? Um, I'm gonna be honest, I don't even know if he's trying to kill us anymore or just torment me to death. But he's got an army of cannibals and two other crazed maniacs on his side, so chances of survival right now are very slim. Jesus. Well, we shouldn't have come here. <laughs> Probably not. Where's the rest of your group? Uh, yeah, we got some guys there, uh, raiding their, um, newly abandoned base. And, um, the rest of us are back at camp. 
So you have a fairly large group. Good, that's good. I can offer you a spot with us. Your chance of survival will go up exponentially if you're in a bigger group. Are you all trying to get out of the city? We're gonna keep hunting and then yeah, then we're gonna leave. Okay, we'll stick with you. Just because our chances of survival will go up. And I'm not too keen on dying. What the hell was that? Where did that explosion come from? I'm pretty sure the direction of the abandoned base. Crap. Oh shit. Heard! We need to go!